Hello everybody, welcome back, Hundasha here. Alright, now we need to... We don't need to be... Actually, we didn't get hurt at all. We don't really need to refill on bullets. Probably fine. Probably fine. Uh, we just need to go down into those rooms that we haven't gone into yet. That's it. Of course. Was it that door? No, it's this way. All right, and it's this door. Okie dokie. What's through this artichoke? I don't hear any zombies. That's a good sign. Traces of something burnt here. Vampires? <laughs> Pictures are very interesting. They can be very interesting. What do you mean that this, this, oh. Silver pitcher. Is this it? Is it just ribbons? Oh. Oh, you know, it's gonna do something, isn't it? Yep. Uh-huh. The door is now locked or something, isn't it? No? Oh boy. Oh boy. Eh. Okay. Alright. Yep. So, we need to go in there with the broken shotgun in order to get the working shotgun. I understand now. Yes, I will set the shotgun. Because it will keep me from dying. But we'll take this knife, at least. The dagger, yes. What is this on the couch? Is it just a pillow? I guess it's just a pillow. Alright. Hopefully, room's not full of smudge. Yay, room's not full of smudge. Okay. Wait, how do we... How do we get to that U shape? How do... Oh, it's... it's okay. I see. I see. Mm -mm -mm. Running out of bases that we haven't been to. As well. That we can go to still. I guess let's mess around in the room with the painting more. Because once we go through the door to get the fake shotgun, you know, it's, it's going to lock us out. So, back into this stupid place. We must activate the lights of truth. Bring the lights of truth to the three spirits. Oh my god, so it decides... I have to change... The sides, both sides, to, wait, what? Oh, 
Oh, the two colors in combination? Is that it? So I have to make it like different. Okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, I get it. I get it. I see. I thought that looked wrong. It wasn't yellow, it's orange. I didn't know that there were different combinations on both sides. There we go. Up and sesame! And what's this? It's a weird shaped rock! And monster attack? Monster attack? No monster attack, really? I am shocked. Oh, sweet. You did tell me. And I knew it had to be a combination, but I didn't realize that there were different lights on the other side. Does this just lead back out? Oh, it does. Huh. Cool. So we have three of the masks. Okay. There's nothing else downstairs. So, I mean, just go back through this. Go back through this. Go to the box. Open the box. Just redistribute our gubbins. And then, I guess... What? There's that one room. The snake room. That the, probably the house key goes to. And then everything else is the helmet key. So... Go through here. I know, it, there, there have been some rooms that were just horrific. Just horrific camera angles. All, all just nothing but pain. Alright, and then put this in with the other ink ribbons. Put you with the other masks. Put you up there. That's fine, that's fine. Take the broken shotgun. I need that to get into the one room. I think I'll need that. Will that, will that go? That outside door? We know that the shotgun's something I need to pick up. Let's put this here for now. We'll see. We'll see. And uh, we'll see if I can slide it into that door. Now I have to run back around again. Okay. Upstairs. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Oh, I didn't. Okay. I should refill the bullets in my gun. There were masks in Resident Evil 8? I'm trying to remember what masks were in Resident Evil 8. Oh, you're right, yeah, the, the, the four that go on the... Interesting, that's a, comp that's a connection. Ah, 69, nice. Um, but yeah, it's an interesting, like, connection, too. The, uh, the masks here, there's four of, and there's four in Resident Evil 8. I've totally forgotten about those. As you could tell by me just asking what masks in Resident Evil 8. Alright, then up the stairs we go. Trapesing around through the old house.
you know, if, if I understand my lore correctly, this place was built by the guy that lived in, in that village in Resident Evil 8. So, and assuming the lore connects all the games together, which it may not do anymore. Uh, downstairs. Wait. Could we just fast track that, can't we? I mean, yeah, yeah, we can. We can just use the outside secrety door. Ho oh, ho! Uh, no, not the Duke. Um, there's a guy that, uh, it, at the very end of the, at the game, you learn about, and he, uh, used to live in the village at some point in the past. And he left and wished, um, Mother Miranda the best of luck in her endeavors while he went out and made... Uh, his own stuff, and he's the one who started the Resident Evil Corporation and all that, all that jazz. He took the emblem of the Four Lords and made the Umbrella Corporation logo out of it. I don't remember his name. And again, I don't know if Seven and Eight the lore is actually tied into Resident Evil lore because it's kind of like a sort of reboot thing. Uh, now we're really close to that, but let's grab the shotgun first. Yeah, yeah, him. Gonna take the shotgun and place the re the fake one in its place. Well, not fake, but broken. No. No. Why won't you let me place the bro the broken shotgun? What? 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 Oh, right, I have to take this one and then inventory the other one. Uh, geez. There. All right, that's better. And the ceiling does not try to kill us. We have acquired the shotgun. Yeah, sometimes old games are a little confusing. More than sometimes. Oh, and especially like I think this was still 90s. Uh, maybe 90, 90... maybe it was 2000. Uh, does this fit? Darn. Okay. That's locked. Of course. Back into the house we go, since that does not go there. I'm guessing it goes at the entrance to that red door in the very center of the map. 
Or maybe here? I don't know what dispenser family. What I would be what knowledge I should uh, accrue from that. Alright, well, we need to go back to that room and drop that out of right, well we could just put it in the thing. Eh, we could just put it in the thing. Since presumably Hmm. I need to call it a part anyway, so I'll do this all in the next part. So, thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this, please feel free to click on anything else on my channels. I want you to be safe and stay awesome. This is Asher. Signing out.